Good morning. So it's been a while since I've done a video, about a week. Um, last video was when my sister and her girlfriend came up and we did a couple of fun things. It was a very uh, short and sweet, kind of ended abruptly, um, but it was a lot of fun. It was cool to have my sister come up and visit me in Florida. Um, you know, still being new to Florida, I don't have any friends up here, or down here rather. So, it was cool. It was cool to have her. Um, so, it is early morning, and that's a bright light. Um, so, today, I'm kind of excited. Very excited, actually. I have my school orientation. Now, for those who've been watching my videos, probably know that, like, I've been talking about school, and I've technically already been doing school. Uh, I've been doing online classes since January, end of January. Um, but I am making my transition from online courses to campus. Uh, so it's very exciting. Uh, along with that, um, I get a new computer. I get a brand new 2017 MacBook Pro. Uh, some great software to help me throughout my schooling. Uh, and probably a bunch of different events, get a feel for actually being on campus today. So it's very exciting. Um, we'll see how it goes. I'm going to try to videotape. Videotape? Who says videotape? I don't know. I'm going to try to record as much as possible. Uh, but I'm going to shower, get a coffee, and get ready. Let's do this. Alright, so I'm walking home right now, and it is, I'm not sure what time it is, but I just finished the very first portion of my orientation, which was fun and interesting, it was very quick, uh, basically paperwork, uh, I've got my schedule for the week, uh, so I actually have to go back in a few hours to do a meet and greet with uh, like the program director for my program. So that should be fun. So tomorrow it looks like I get my new computer as well as get like a welcoming to the campus. So we'll see how that goes. This is day two of orientation. So, with orientation, so, dude. you meet two people, <laughs> such as Pat. What's up? I'm Pat Burns. And Ra Raj. Raj. I just said Raj. 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 <laughs> Sorry, bud. So, this is day two. I'm not going to do a daily vlog of orientation. I'm just going to kind of couple it all together into one. But um, today should be a very good day because we get our MacBook Pros. Okay. All of us do. So, Raj is going to get a backpack. We're at the mall now so that he has something to put his MacBook in. So, I'm not going to film too much of the school because I want to focus on what we're talking about and doing. So, we will update you soon. Later. Bam, there it is. This is everybody else. Apparently, I can't do this one handed. Alright. Damn. Well, look at that. So there it is. I'm going to put this down because I actually want to touch this thing. Figure it out. Yeah, that's a massive track bed. That's pretty sexy. I'm not going to lie. Look at all these people. It's crazy. Hey, yo. So, back home from getting our launch box set up, which I wasn't expecting to get all of today, but very exciting. Um, I filmed a little bit within the, uh, when we got our MacBook, so you probably saw some of that, but I'm gonna change my camera view and show a little bit of what I got. So without minding the mess in the apartment, so we have the obviously the 2017 MacBook 
Uh, it's a 15 inch with uh, touch bar and retina display, is that correct there? It's got the 500 500 gig solid state hard drive, yep. two graphics cards, 16 gigs of RAM. It's an i7 quad. quad core processor. So. Turbo 3.6 gigahertz. Yeah. So this thing is a beast. Uh, it's very cool. I'm really liking this uh, this touch bar, which I'm about to touch and delete emails, which don't look at my email. Um, along with the computer, because uh, with the 2017, they do eliminate your... Uh, obviously, CD drive has been eliminated a while ago, um, but instead of your like SD card slots and your typical uh, USB Type A slots, uh, they're doing Type C USB. Uh, so with that, they give you a USB uh, port hub, uh, so that you can still obviously utilize regular USB Type A uh, gigabit, gigabit rather USB C to Ethernet adapter. Um, and some other cords with that so that we got that with the computer uh, and did set up within class and then alongside that we did receive the rest of our launch box now with uh, programs within the school everybody gets a computer uh, which we did find out that not everybody gets the same computer but most it's, uh, the film kids or something get yeah yeah, it's like 98% of people get the this model, basically. Uh, but along with that, we the show production, and I, you kind of met Pat earlier, uh, who's also a show production student. Uh, a lot of the videos. <laughs> yeah, he'll be in a lot of the videos. Uh, we got some different equipment, so I'll show some of that. Um, one cool thing is the Sennheiser uh, headphones that they give you. Um, from other students who have done videos of this nature, introducing their uh, equipment. Obviously, Sennheiser is a stand-up company and makes good equipment, so the headphones, I'm sure, will fall under that same category. Uh, along with the headphones, Sennheiser also gives us a condenser mic. Uh, or is this dynamic? It's compressing. Compressing. Thank you. We'll get back to that. It's a microphone, nonetheless. Uh, so that was very cool. Um, yep. So it's the uh, 600-800 series. Um, so we'll focus more on that. It's got iLock. iLock, which... Um, Manages all your uh, licenses on all your softwares. Yep. So that would be fucking handy. I didn't quite know what that, so Pat has helped me out here explaining stuff because I... Don't know everything right off the bat. I read the other crap you didn't read. <laughs> I, I didn't do all the reading. Uh, desktop microphone stand or a kick drum microphone stand, whatever you want to call it. Um, and one of the things I'm pretty excited for is the uh, Scarlett, uh, which is a USB audio interface. Um, it does come with some Ableton Live. Um, we will be getting uh, Pro Tools as a software download. Pro Tools 10, right? Yeah. Yep. Um, the whole suite. The whole suite, which is awesome. Um, I'm trying to, am I forgetting anything that we're getting? Uh, we do get an XLR cable uh, so that you can hook up your Sennheiser to your Focusrite. Yeah, Alan Parsons, like music. Uh, yeah, there, like there's a, like a digital uh, video book, some stuff that you can read up on from, I think his name was Alan Parsons. Uh, so we'll be getting that. Um, that will be a digital download. One thing that was really cool that we got, along with the, the iLock to uh, manage all your licensing, uh, we do get a student edition of LoJack, uh, basically, so you can keep track of your beast of a MacBook, so that you know. It gets stolen, you know where it is. It gets stolen, or you misplace it like a fucking moron. Will happen. Which will I, I say? Which would happen? But um, yeah, exactly. So those are a couple of things. Uh, I know me and Pat both said that on YouTube there is no um, show production students showing kind of a little bit of the launch box. So we both kind of wanted to talk about that. I'm sure Pat will do something on his Instagram or Facebook or Twitter or anything like that. At some point, I'll grab his Pat's social media to check out. I just showed that that was a moron move. 
What am I? Oh my god. We'll cut that out. Anyways. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, vlogging is still new. <laughs> my dog just looking at me like I'm an idiot. Here, this is Pro Tools. That's what it looks like. That's if good. anyone ever wanted to know what it looks like, a yep. thousand bucks gets you this card, bro. Oh yeah. It's all you need. More than a thousand. Well, well that Pro Tools, yeah, just alone. But. Just alone. But yeah, so there's all my trash from opening the box. But we got some stuff. And I'm going to play around with the MacBook and get it, you know, all personalized and check out everything. So uh, probably going to be doing, I know we have a Mac book, like class essentials thing that me and Pat are going to do tomorrow. Um, yeah. So fun stuff. Ew, so I think originally I was going to do a full video of the full orientation week, uh, but I think I'm going to break it up. Um, I think I'm going to end it on day two. So I am wicked tired right now. Um, I am not necessarily a morning person slash I'm kind of an idiot and usually I stay up late. Usually I'm still used to staying up till like three or four in the morning. Um, but obviously with orientation week and making the transition from online schooling to campus world, I have to get myself in a sleep schedule. So I'm extremely tired right now because it's my own fault and no one else's. But I digress. So orientation, first week, um, kind of already saw, met some really cool people um, who I've already become friends with. We got our MacBook, which we got today, which is a freaking amazing machine. Uh, all of our other equipment we got some more software and stuff coming in uh, you saw me kind of talk about that briefly um, for anyone not interested in that uh, I'll probably talk about um, other stuff later on I don't know but bear with me still new to these vlogs as you know um, yeah we get tired um, so I start a new class here in the next few days. Uh, I start um, my creative writing class, which is actually an online class. I technically am making the transition from online schooling to um, to uh, campus life, but my first class in that transition is an online class, so it's kind of the same. But I do creative writing. I'm finishing up the class I have now. Um, this week for the rest of orientation, I got a couple of workshops and stuff like that. Uh, one exciting thing is last night I signed up for what our school offers. It's called a student event crew. Uh, so where I do show production stuff, um, the student event crew has the option of doing um, different events like working with the NXT, uh, any school driven events such as graduations because technically there's a graduation each month for that school. Um, so yeah, so it'll be fun. Sorry, I'm being distracted because my dog's being a moron. But um, should be fun. So like I said, I got, I'm excited because I signed up for that. And this weekend I actually uh, should be doing an event, uh, hopefully in Tampa. It's at like a Air Force base or something like that. I don't know, but they're hosting an event. They did a crew call. I signed up. So hopefully doing that this weekend. So it should be a good time. Say hi to Rachel. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> She's tired as well. Work a long day. Anyways, so probably gonna stop rambling now and close up the video. Uh, I didn't say it in the last video, um, and like I said, this week has kind of been a jumble. But for the people who are watching and there you are again. Oh. Anyways, for the people who are watching these videos, thank you for watching. Um, I usually try to add a little link somewhere in this general vicinity of my last video I did. That if you want to check them out, go ahead and watch. Uh, you can hit the subscribe button so that you can see when I post videos. Um, like the video if you enjoyed it. The main thing that I really want people to do is comment or, or hit me up on social media. Um, I always answer comments. Um, that was one of the main reasons why I started this vlog is because I want to network 
and connect with people. That's a whole part of you know this college life and everything that I'm doing is I want to connect with people. Uh, it helps me with my professional career and personal life too. So definitely leave a comment, hit me up on social media. Links will be in the description. Uh, but thank you, and I'll probably be posting more of the orientation <laughs> uh, from the rest of this week, hopefully soon. So.